On December 26th, our school was hit by um, what we're being told is an EF3 tornado in Glen Heights. And so, of course, my heart dropped. And when I got there, it was already night. There was no electricity. I couldn't see anything, but I could see everything. Um, we had flashlights and lanterns and just <laughs> the amount of destruction that I could see at night um, I was devastated. But the next morning when we came at first light, that it, it couldn't even describe what we'd seen that night before. And so I, I really was speechless. I, I, didn't, I didn't realize the amount of damage that had, had occurred until that moment at daybreak when we were there. And our library was one of the major places in the building that was totally destroyed and so we lost all of our books. So of course, librarians, we want to get books in the hands of children, so that was our number one. And when we heard that the library had no books, it was just <whistles> So of course we wanted to help. <laughs> so this all started with an email from Ebony, whose mom is a fifth grade teacher here and she was hoping to collect 500 books for the school. And I responded and said, we're gonna try and collect 5,000. And we beat it, we got them 5,077 books. 5,000, that's, wow, <laughs> that's incredible. Of course, I think they were a little shocked to see that big truck pull up. You know, they were expecting 500 books. Um, but I think they're thrilled and we're going to come back and help. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate y'all so much. But to hear 5,000 plus, um, it's unreal. To have a book, it's like an old friend and you can, you know, go away into a far place and, you know, escape and forget some of the devastation that happened in their neighborhood. You know, they're in a temporary school. They're not even in their school. So it's a lot of change for these kids, but they can find a story that they love and reconnect. I just want to say thank you to everybody who has donated, who has volunteered, who has thought about us, and particularly the people who know that books are really all about that's that's the school that's our center and our library is our center and we want our kids to be okay with coming in knowing that now they have more to choose from so we are grateful.